energy vibration reading for the month of September I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back this is the energy vibration for the Gemini's okay month of September is the month of the devil month of the devil is a fire energy um, what that is saying is that um, there is a lot of situation unjust situation that is going to be in balance whatever unjust situation that you have been dealing with is going to come to an end it's finally going to come to an end some of you uh, who have been um, unjustly accused and that sort of a thing it's going to finally come to an end I want to say to each and every person that mm, the first week of September is going to be one of the best week for you air sign people um, that's the only time the energy vibration of the hair is in the month um, it is a month of four weeks and it has carries the energy vibration of the fire energy the energy of the devil but you have a um, supporting energy of the hurt which is the air offense so it's a group of people and organization whatever negativity that you have been dealing with is going to um, basically come to an end the energy of the devil is here which this is the sense of transformation that is coming up okay so let's go in and look at these energies I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back thank you for the wonderful support likes and shares um, it is a time where you are going to be um, finding out a lot of secrets is going to come in out a lot of people that has been lying and that sort of a situation that is going to be coming out um, I want to say also I love you guys and um, as from this month you can pick up the extended reading of the, of the entire reading if you click on the, the link below it's going to take you to my um, web page and there you have the um, demand video demand 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 on demand on my um, website page okay so um, and let's see what is coming out I'm seeing the nine of cups I'm seeing the nine of cups energy that is coming out here so obviously your angels and guides have, um, show um, the, the energy of the week so in the first week you have the energy of the nine of cups so whoever you are the energy of the nine of cups is coming out for you guys in this first week so you Gemini's you have um, the first week the nine of cups so if there was uh, and the first week is your best week so some of you Gemini's your wishes and dreams are going to be coming out in the first week of September so um, this is good in the second week you have the seven of wands whatever is happening the energy of the seven of wands is coming out and um, what is transpiring is that um, the seven of ones has to do with conflicts and you standing your ground against a situation whatever this conflicts is and you're standing your grounds about it's going to come to an end because the energy of the the debt is over the situation so obviously um, there has been in just situation because the month is the energy of um, um, the low energy of people who are dishonest this honest situation has been going around and you're standing your ground and this is going to come to an end okay wonderful wonderful energy so um, the first week is going to be fabulous it's going to be the best week for you guys the second week is a fire energy for you guys that has to do with you seeing the truth of a situation and you're standing your ground which is a really really wonderful then as we move forward um, you have the six of cups the six of cups is a situation with a pass um, with a family member for some of you or with your soul family so some of you it's going to be um, with groups of people who you connect with um, who's your soul family and some of you it's with your a hurt family the people who you were born um, as a member of their family okay so of you standing your ground against the situation whatever the situation is you're basically standing your ground against and a situation that you're seeing playing out and you're really really standing your ground um, and um, it could be someone who you have known from the past it could be a, a, um, a karmatic family a family a karmatic family situation but whoever these people and situation are you're standing your ground and there's going to be um, in the month of September an end is going to be coming for the week of September um, you have the three of ones so you are going to be leaving the situation behind so um, obviously um, um, you're moving out of the month of August into um, September with 
whatever you're wishing and dreaming and open for it's going to be happening but you're standing your ground because there are unjust situations there was unjust situations that has taken place and this has to do with a pa um, someone uh, in your family or someone who uh, you have connected with someone who you feel um, a soul connection with and now you're deciding to leave the situation behind because you have the energy of the debt coming up okay so you're ending this situation so the fourth week you're deciding to move away from a situation the fourth week you decided that whoever this person or situation is it could be a you know you're in a relationship and you're finding out the truth to this person that the person didn't connect to you um as a love partner but the person connects with you for other meaning other materialistic um things and meaning and um you know you're a little bit upset because um you're thinking how could this person do this you know whatever the conflicts was you're standing your ground let's see what is coming out from the first week going in the second week first week going in the second week there are conflicts so, and you could be having conflicts with um, the, the um, Aries Leo, Aries Leo or Sagittarius people. You could be having some conflicts with this Aries Leo or Sagittarius people, and you're standing your ground. But you could be having huge um, conflicts. And you know, look at the situation. Look at what you're doing because obviously, um, some of you are not being honest about a situation. Some of you are really not being honest about a situation. So you need to really be honest with yourself. Okay. As we look at the second week, going in the third week, where you have a family situation and injustice. I'm not doing this. I'm not doing this, you guys. <laughs> Um, the energy of the Sun comes out and the energy of the Sun also comes out for the Aquarian so obviously it's an healing that is coming in for you um, hair sign people so whatever the conflicts is you know there is an, a debt an ending that is going to be coming to whatever conflicts is energy of the Sun comes back out I can't change it this is what I've received so I can't change it so obviously whatever the injustice and whatever the conflicts that was happening it's coming now to an end let's look at the for the Gemini for the um, um, for week going in the the third week going in the fifth week there's good news that is going to be coming there is some good news that is going to be coming this conflict is going to be coming to an end and there is some um, good news that is coming this is um, really good because um, whatever is transpiring um, some of you are going to be ending a situation and decide to move away from this situation and by doing that um, you're going to be seeing this positive situation where you're ending a situation let's see what is this conflicts and the Sun energy of the conflicts of the, and the Sun is uh, the energy of the lies that has been told whatever lies that has been told uh, um, the lies that have been told is coming to an end okay so obviously because it's this is happening in the second week the second week um, there's conflicts over some lies that has been told and um, the energy of the Sun comes and it has to do with a soul family it's, it's as if this person is a soul family or a family member there was some lies that has been told and the truth came out about a soul family or a family member okay and now there is going to be an ending to this uh, situation once and for all now as we look at the Sun and the good news that is coming um, the energy of the page of swords so some information um, will be coming in this information the um, news is going to be coming in news is going to be coming in and you are going to decide to end whatever the situation was you're going to be deciding to end it okay because news are going to be coming in and um, here you can see that you decide to end a situation because um, whatever happened um, the first week your wishes and dreams came 
um, out and you decide to end a, a situation you stand your ground against an injustice against yourself or a family member or as someone you have known from the past and you decide to turn your back and end the situation and you're going to be receiving good news information is going to be coming in um, to you about the situation okay because um it was something that was injustice that you have played a part with and now you're ending it the outcomes of your month is the energy of the king of Pentacles the outcomes of your month is the energy of the king of Pentacles so um, what is happening this is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn man so this Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn man there could be some lies that this person had told whoever this man is there could be some lies that this man had told and now the truth is coming out there could be some lies that this man has told and now the truth is coming out so the outcomes is um, the energy of the King of Pentacles. The King of Pentacles is a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn. Um, whoever this person is, this person had. Um, um, you can see that this person had um, told some lies. Um, whatever this person um, had did, this person had told some lies, and the energy of that this is going to be coming out in the second week so your outcomes of the month is basically for most of the people in the second week going on in the third week that's why you stand your grounds to someone who you have known from this past and this person this person that is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn it could have been someone who you have known from a past life and whatever this information that this person um, told or is going to bring it's going to end a situation because it's as if there was some lies and deceptiveness that has happened and now it is basically coming out because I'm seeing um, the ten of swords which is lies and deceptive information lies it's communication so it's lies and deceptive information and you're going to be receiving news about this um, king of Pentacles this man that he has lied he had lied about a situation and be very deceptive about a situation and you know this news is going to be coming and because in the last week you decide to leave this a situation behind that has to do with this um, this this king of Pentacles this is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn Um sometimes people say you know it, it, it can be um, a woman or a man it can be a woman or a man but but what I'm seeing here because it is injustice is it's injustice and this person is over the age of 40 and this is really a man it's a masculine month it's it's so masculine so um there is an ending there is an ending because there was some lies there was conflicts and some lies that has been told and there is an ending whoever the Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person was they could have um um, um, you know deceptively um, say things that wasn't true and um, you have found out about it and you you know the truth is going to be coming out the truth is going to be coming out and I love when this happened because sometimes these people are, are being very deceptive people can be very deceptive and create um, conflict and illusion for other people and whoever this person is they're going to be finding out what is uh, whatever um, happened and whatever transpired and it's all about money this man and lie and and does injustice thing and it is all about money okay so for your month is just a transformation an ending to a period an ending to a cycle in your life okay so your month is really a, a transformation an ending to a period or a, a cycle in your life that needs to come to an end okay um, so an, an ending to a period in your life okay there is an ending to a cycle or a period in your life okay um, 
and now positive the shift the shift so it's going to be the shift the shift and an ending um, to a period in your life okay so this is wonderful for um, the extended um, the full reading please um, um, uh, uh, please connect to the link below and it will take you to the on demand on my website page okay so for the people that will like the